Blue Jays hosting the White Sox at Rogers Center. Jackie Robinson Day being celebrated north of the border as the number 42 all over Major League Baseball on this Monday. Mark Burley facing his former club in some trouble. Top of the first facing Paul Canerco, two on and one away. And Canerco comes through the RBI single, scoring Jeff Kepinger as the White Sox strike first. They have a 1-0 lead. Two batters later, it is first and second again, this time two men away. Burley facing Dion Viciedo, and Viciedo, they get little bloop into left center. Good enough to score Alex Rios, and the White Sox build a 2-0 lead after half an inning. Home half of the first, now 2-1. It is J.P. Aaron Sebia facing Gavin Floyd. Ball is driven to right and deep. Rios looking up. It is off the top of the wall. And J.P. Aaron Sebia saw a lot of pitches outside, and he stayed on that one, and it's his fourth over of the season. We are right back to square one. It's a 2-2 ball game. And that takes us to the bottom of the second. It's Meiser Esturis leading off the frame facing Floyd. Upstairs, high and deep to right. Rios at the track, at the wall. Number two for Esturis. And that puts the Jays on top, 3-2 to two as we move to the fifth. Now a 4-2 game. It is Burley facing Canerco again, this time runners on the corners, two men away, and Burley wins this battle as Canerco swings and misses. Burley would go six and a third, giving up two runs, and he scatters nine hits on the night. So let's go to the top of the eighth. It is the White Sox, another threat, second and third, one away. Aaron Loop, the lefty, dealing to Alexei Ramirez as he sends this one to center field. Colby Rasmus makes the catch. Adam Dunn tags and scores from third. Pinch runner Dwayne Wise tags and advances to third. It's now just a one-run game at 4-3. Next batter for the White Sox, Tyler Flowers with the tying run at 90 feet away. But Flowers, the swing and a miss at the loop fastball. And the Jays get out of the threat. The White Sox leave the tying run at third. Casey Jansen pitched a perfect ninth for his fourth save. Jays go on for the 4-3 win. Burley gets the victory in his first career start against the team that drafted him back in 1998 and spent a dozen seasons with as he picks up his first win as a Blue Jay in the process. The White Sox fall to 1-6 and six on their current 10-game road trip.